Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And I just made a video about finding replaceable on some lines. And I thought I'd just make another video on how useful this could be. If we go to edit, find and replace, edit query. And line, you have to go down to lines and double check. And see, so I already have checked because I was just using it. But double ch check, double click on the properties. And we want to find, we don't want the width right now. We want a color and we want, we don't know what color it is. We're going to take the eyedropper tool and we know what color it is, but we're just playing. And then find all. While you've got them all selected, you can go to your pen tool, make them 36 points and round in any caps. You haven't changed the black. So let's just do it again. Edit. Go down to pin, outline properties. This time we'll find black, which we know is black, but I don't know which black it is. So we'll let Corel decide. Find all. This time we're going to make it, uh, let's just make it, uh, we made the other ones 36. Let's just make it 16 so we can tell the difference. Now what's also good about find and replace Let's say you, and you can always select them all and right click your mouse and change them all red. But let's say we want to, we want to change just the thicker lines. Edit query. Go down to, uh, I always like to move it out of the way. Outline properties. This time take away color, go for width. We want exactly 36 points. Say, okay, find all. No objects found. 36 points. Should have worked. Let's go back. Outline properties. You know, I had width probably selected. I mean, color selected also. 36 points. It should work. There it goes. I must have the color check too, and it was kind of messing it up. And then you could make those black. So find and replace is a really powerful tool if you've got a lot on your sheet. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.